Ryan, tell the truth. I am telling the truth. You're accusing me when Jimmy's sitting right there with the broken plate. Yeah, Mom, he just got home like five minutes ago. He's been out all day. So you're saying you did it? No, you still did it. Come on, Mom, that's a dead giveaway. Mm, he's still saying you did it. Well, what if I say he did it like I've been trying to do? I know you're lying. How the... Am I lying? He just confessed to my alibi. But he said you did it. Hey. First time. I believe I failed my exam. You failed? Me too! Hey! You failed? <laughs> ha! Better start applying now. Ryan, you failed? Haven't I heard this enough yet? I'm disappointed, but not surprised. Dark and difficult times lie ahead. If Dad finds out, you'll be erased from this plane of existence. And that's why he won't find out. Ryan, could you pass me the remote? Yeah, here you go. Great. At least you can still pass something. Rick, pronounce this. 1999. Jonathan? Uh, uh, 1888. Ryan? 11, 11, 11. No. Gerald? 11, 11, 11. Martin? 11, 11, 11. Matthew? One to the power of four? All right, let's just move on. Uh, hopefully your homework won't give me this much of a headache. Homework? Yes, didn't you do... Did any of you do your homework? I did, sir. You don't count, you suck up. Eric, did you do your homework? I forgot. Jonathan? I didn't know there was homework. Ryan? Uh, my dog ate my homework, sir. Matthew? Huh? Uh, my, my dog forgot to do my homework. Martin? My cat ate my homework, and then my science project ate my cat. Gregory? I did it. Oh, thank you. But my brother put it on eBay, and... I. I tried to get it back, but I wasn't the highest bidder. I'm surrounded by idiots. Hey, wake up! <laughs> School is not a place to sleep! Well, then home is not a place to study. Jonathan, stop eating in my class! Dude, didn't you have breakfast this morning? No, but I didn't have time for my second breakfast. Jonathan! First eating, then talking. Now talking while you're eating. Since you've got so much to say, name ten elements on the periodic table. Second breakfast. Can I just say that... Of all the idiots, in all the idiot villages, in all the idiot worlds, you stand alone, my friend. Fine, I'll come write it on the board if you don't believe me. Second breakfast. He is officially the smartest kid in the world. His mind is greater than all of ours combined. His brain power transcends time and space. Should we tell him? Absolutely not. This not possible. Sometimes my genius is... It's almost frightening. Sir? Hmm? What do you want? Why do we need school? What level of idiot are you exactly? Hear me out, sir. Okay. Where else are you gonna learn English and grammar? What does it matter? Everything's shortened anyway. BRB, LOL, IDK, IKR, GG, ASAP. Alright, what about geography? That's why we have these things. History? They're all dead. Ever heard of let the past be the past? Learning how to write? Texting. Learning other languages like Spanish? Three words. Dora the Explorer. Music class? Spotify. YouTube. Take your pick. Drama class? Are you serious? You haven't heard of this thing called TikTok? Should we stop this? No. Let him cook. You've got to be kidding me. What about science? This is the only science I need to know. Sports, VR, and the good old Wii. How about math? Huh? Where was the Declaration of Independence signed? At the bottom of the page. How can you drop a raw egg onto a concrete floor without cracking it? Any way you want. Concrete is quite hard to crack. Can we let someone else answer? Thank you. Sir, can I ask you a question? You just did. Can I ask you two questions? You just did. Can I ask you four questions? No. Why? You did. Just now. Why do you have coffee every day, sir? Are you gonna die without it? No. But you might. Sir, can you please help us out on what to study for the exam specifically instead of just saying the whole textbook? No. No, I don't think I will. Mom, can we go to the park? Not now. We can go tomorrow. All right. Sweet. I summon you to fulfill your oath. Brain not braining. Study not studying. Sleep not sleeping. Money not moneying. Nobody loving. Everybody hating. Mouth always eating. Eyes always watering. Nothing understanding. Heck, the what happening?
Brain not braining, study not studying, sleep not sleeping, money not moneying, nobody loving, everybody hating, mouth always eating, eyes always watering, nothing understanding. Heck, the what happening? Son, go clean your room, guests are coming over later, and it's filthy in there. It's my room, it's my house. Well then, you go clean it. You dare use my own spells against me, possibly. It's so beautiful. You're next. Mm-hmm, yeah. Hey, you're next. Okay, I'll leave. Wait, where'd you go? Sunday? Have I got a fat? What? You slay queen! You're beautiful! No, you're beautiful! You're beautiful! Dude, do you think I'm fat? I know five fat people, and you're four of them. Huh? Ryan, you got a 55% on the test. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> and that's the highest anyone has gotten in the class. Am I better than everyone? I only got nine hours of sleep last night. Nine? I only got seven. Seven? I only get four! You guys are getting sleep? Brian, put the phone away. You need your eight hours of sleep. Three, take it or leave it. All right, son, since you got straight A's this semester, here's 50 bucks. Well done, champ. So disappointed in you. Look at me when I'm talking to you. You've got some nerve to look at me like that. Answer me, why are you so quiet? I knew you were hiding something. I'm sorry, Dad. How dare you talk back to me? What do you want from me? Gosh. Hey, watch that tone, young man. Hi, can I just get a burger and fries, please? Okay, will that be all, sir? The first order was just the beginning. I will give you so much more. You'll be lucky you get anything. Just order and get done. Hey! Who the heck drank my soda? <clears throat> I did. What are you gonna do about it? Hey, man. I think you got him. You want what he's having? No. That's what I thought. Just this. Forgot them! Mm, the answer's gotta be 15. No, the answer's 12. Oh my, I'm sorry, you're both wrong? The answer's green. This is algebra. X equals green. I have very little patience for stupidity. What? What? Do you want to pass the class? Or... Do you want to pass away? Well, with all this work, sir, I've only been getting like four hours of sleep. Yeah, scientifically, we need six to eight hours of sleep. Okay. Well, you know what? I agree. I also agree, sir. <laughs> well, that backfired. Get out. Excuse me? Get out! The nerve of this kid. I'd do it before mom walks in. You know what? Call her. I have as much right to be in this house as you two. I have had enough! Wanna say that again? Whoever you are? I said I've had enough! <laughs> <sighs> he forgot to check my homework. There's nothing here. Ooh, I'm gonna tell the teacher. What? No, please don't, 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 don't. <sighs> Mrs. Stevens! What? <laughs> May I go to the bathroom? All I do is win, 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 no matter what. I may be 80 years old, boy, but I got the body of a 20 year old. Yeah, Grandpa. Of course you do. Look at that. I'm serious. Oh yeah? Prove it. <laughs> oh, it's just Billy. But hey, this award doesn't just belong to me. This was a team effort. All of mankind will benefit from this.
Will I be punished for something I didn't do? No, honey. What kind of question is that? Okay, because I didn't do my homework, I didn't take out the trash, and I didn't clean my room. It's time to move. When I grow up, I want to be a scientist. That's my smart boy. Dad, I'm going to be a pilot one day. A pilot? You can't drive a car, let alone a plane. Stick to walking. All right, I'd say engineering is the way to go. Yes, honey, now you can finally help me find the on button. Hey, what's up, guys? It's your boy. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel, and turn on the bell button. This generation. Mom, I'm hungry. There's nothing to eat. What are you talking about? There's more than enough food. Stop acting so spoiled. Ryan, come on, dinner's ready. These are my kids. My kids don't fight like little Teletubbies. Mom, I'm hungry. There's nothing to eat. What are you talking about? There's more than enough food. Stop acting so spoiled. Ryan, come on, dinner's ready. These are my kids. My kids don't fight like little Teletubbies. Listen up. Can anyone tell me what element this is? Um... And remember, there are no wrong answers, as long as you try. Earth? Now see, class, it's fine. You got it wrong. Oh! What was that, sir? That, Franklin, was the element of surprise. Boy, do not bite the hand that feeds you, you hear me? <laughs> Hey mom, remember when you told me I'd learn everything I'd ever need to know in school? Yeah. Well, I never learned how to do taxes, what taxes are, how to manage money, anything about banking, how to grow food, how to handle rejection, how to love myself, how to handle interviews, how to buy my first home, how to survive in the wild, or how to handle myself in dangerous situations. But I sure am glad I know the Pythagorean theorem. Oh my. How did he finish so fast? I know, he's a genius. I must become his disciple. Could he be the one the prophecy spoke of? We are not worthy. Ha! Freaking idiot. Someone didn't study. Great. Another one repeating my class next year. Okay, at least I'll do better than him now. Congratulations, you played yourself. Uh... Get up! You got things to do, people to meet, food to eat, and butts to kick. Oi! What? You wanna sleep tonight? Get to work. May I offer quite a delectable selection of your worst memories from the past ten years? No, please. Don't do this. Ah, it's rewind time. Yeah, I'm the top dog around these parts, but not that much of a surprise, really. Oh, give me a break. Pretty soon, we'll be able to fly. Don't count us out. We're very dangerous. We're lethal. Ah, children. Are you done, or do I have to step in? You can step aside. The big kahuna is here. Take a hike, furball. You're out of your league. The most dangerous animal on this planet. A violent creature filled with hateful thoughts and a lust for blood. Teeth like razors to suck the meat from your bone. Yes, when all is said and done, she is a killer. Dad, I think we've been spotted. What? Teacher, someone lost their pencil. I'd like to return it. Oh, someone forgot their pencil. Should I keep it, or should I find out whose it is? There is that law of finders keepers, losers reapers, and it's illegal not to follow the law. So, I'm obligated to keep it. Makes sense. A pencil. Thank you, Jesus, for bestowing this gift upon me. Hi, my name is Ryan. I'll be your server today. And just so you know, children under 10 eat free today. Oh, well, that's fantastic. He's nine years old. And you know what? I'll just have a water, and he'll have the chicken nuggets with some fries, and a five pound steak, a whole chicken with the lemon sauce, a beef wellington, five eggs, four pancakes with the syrup and Nutella, and top it off with about four cream sodas. Wait, I'm 19. Be silent. Keep your full tongue behind your teeth.
You know, dude, if a barber makes a mistake, it's a new style. Yeah, you got a point. And if a politician makes a mistake, it's a new law. And if a scientist makes a mistake, it's a new invention. If a tailor makes a mistake, it's a new fashion statement. If a teacher makes a mistake, it's a new theory. But if we make a mistake, it's a mistake. Hey, don't act like a victim. I reminded you yesterday that the assignment, and I quote, is due tomorrow. All I heard was due tomorrow. Maybe you are the mistake. It's freezing in here. Are you kidding me? Oh no. Here's the coffee. Rough day. You have no idea. How do you see your students? I mean, it's best that you see them like Happy Lama, Sad Lama, Mentally Disturbed Lama, Super Lama, Drama Lama, Big Fat Mama Lama Jefferson, hmm? how do you see your students? In person or online? Oh, in person. What do you think? Giving them five assignments, three tests, four oral exams, and ten pop quizzes? Far more fun in person. We messed up, man. We messed up big time. What the heck is this? It was perfect. Perfect. Everything. Down to the last minute detail. <laughs> we messed up, man. We messed up big time. What the heck is this? It was perfect. Perfect. Everything. Down to the last minute detail. Bro, if the number two pencil is the most popular pencil, why is it still number two? Dude, come on. I'm trying to enjoy the view. Dude, why does fat chance and slim chance mean the same thing? Doesn't matter how far I go. You'll always find me, won't you? Why are there no B batteries? Finally got away from him. Dude, you gotta be kidding me. Why do British people never sound British when they sing? Oh, come on! At a movie theater, which armrest is yours? Listen up, class. Very poor choice of words. Tell me a sentence that starts with an I. I is the- Stop! Never put is after an I. Always put am after an I. Okay, I am the ninth letter of the alphabet. Got him. Excuse me, can you tell me why you're packing your books away? The bell's about to ring. No, no, get your books out. There's still 24 seconds left of class. Let me guess. The bell does not dismiss us, you dismiss us. Wow, you finally got something right this year. Ooh, got him. Hey, I got a 90 on the test. Hold up. Hey, what? Sir, I got almost all the answers right in this test. Yes, your point. So why did he get a 90 and I got a 40? You didn't show your work. I did the work in my head. Impossible. Should have showed your work. Math is math! That 40 you got there says otherwise. So you're failing me because I didn't do it your way. You have an issue? Here's a tissue. My way. My way or the highway. I miss being in the house. It's lonely out here. You miss everything, Billy. What? You're the middle child. You miss everything. Shut it. I think you're missing my point. I hate you. Jimmy, it's time for dinner. Let's go. C can I come in, Mom? Ryan! Huh? Stop being so lazy. Go check out what that noise is in the yard. Okay. Sir, do you know what the formula for nitrogen oxide is? Right here. No, okay. You're no help. Uh, dude, do you know what the formula for sodium hypobromite is? Whoa, I'm not letting you copy my work again. Nah, bro. No, I just wanna... Sir, do you know what the formula is? Can anyone help me? Dude, do you know what the formula for sodium hydride is? Nah. Sir? Ah! Dude, can I copy your homework? 
What homework? He's talking about the assignment. No, I'm talking about the homework. We have to do the questions on pages 1 through 20. Huh? I thought it was pages 1 through 10. One second. You're telling me there was an assignment due today? I think you're confusing assignment with the oral presentation due this period. Excuse me, what? It's pronounced oral exam. Exam? So you're telling me I did this book report for nothing? So this has nothing to do with math. An oral math exam? Do you hear yourself? All right, so for today, pop quiz. Two minutes and we'll get started. Shocker. Um, you're not gonna believe this, but I got an A on my math test. You just wait till your dad gets home. Pathetic! <laughs> Ryan, what have you done? Get the mop! Get all the toes! Call 911! Um, you're not gonna believe this, but I got an A on my math test. You just wait till your dad gets home. Pathetic! <laughs> Ryan, what have you done? Get the mop! Get all the toes! Call 911! <laughs> <laughs> So we all know that on Earth, there's more water than land. Mm, that's not true. How so? There's more land under the water. Hey, mind telling me why you're late to my class? Sorry, heavy traffic. Is that my fault? Did I blame you? He said it, son of a gun. He actually said it. I should not have said that. Dad, please don't make me walk to school tomorrow. Son, when Abraham Lincoln was your age, he walked 12 miles to get to school. Oh, yeah? Well, Dad? Mm-hmm. When Abraham Lincoln was your age, he was president. Ryan, finish your vegetables that I made you. Come on. But why? Because I'm your mother, and I say so! I could eat a bowl of alphabet soup and poop out a better argument than that. He said it at the cost of his life. Can anyone tell me why humans have different blood groups? So mosquitoes can enjoy different flavors. Haha, <laughs> funny. Now shut it! Sir, can I use the bathroom? It's May I No, use. it's June. Hi, Mr. Johnson? Hey, look, it's the new kid I told you about. Oh, yes, I had a meeting with your parents yesterday, of course. Now, uh, tell me, wh what was their names again? My dad's name is Laughing and my mom's name is Smiling. Oh. <laughs> Are you kidding? No, he's my cousin. I'm joking. We have to recruit him. Hey, stop copying my work. Come on, sharing is caring. Does it look like I care right now? Actually, no. Do you want to talk about it? Turn the other way before I stab you with my pen. Well, aggressive. You should talk to someone about that. I'll show you aggressive. Ryan, no talking during the test. Sir, he's trying to copy my work. I don't care what you were talking about. Just stop talking. I have to say, this is the first time I've seen two people equally fail this pathetically. What? Nice going, you moron. Dude, do you know what happens if you lose your pen? You have no pen, which means no notes taken. And no notes means no study. No study equals fail. A fail means no diploma. No diploma, no work. No work, no money. No money, no food. No food and you'll get skinny. And skinny equals ugly. Dude. And ugly means no love. No love, no marriage. No marriage means no children. No children means all alone. Alone? Depression. Depression, sickness. Sickness eventually leads to death. What are you doing? Cleaning. Just wait for dad to do it. Do you hear yourself sometimes? Dad's in bed sick, you moron! Then make Jimmy do it. He's an idiot. Why are you doing so much, though? To prove to father that I am a worthy son. When he wakes, I will have saved his life, and I will be true heir to the throne. Dad, I, I cleaned everything up. Don't worry about that. And I did the laundry so you can rest well. You're unworthy! Yeah, that's not a surprise. Hey! There's a monster under my bed. Dad! Come on, please check! This is ridiculous. You're getting too old for this. Please just check! Oh, my knee. There's nothing here, son. Nope. Sleep before I put you to sleep. Wait, what? Wow. You really got it rough. Yeah, no kidding. Sir, 
is there anything I can do to help my grade for the exam? It's May. There's no exam. Oh, sorry. May I do anything to help for the exam? You're a special kind of idiot, aren't you? What? Now, class, for the upcoming assignment, you'll need to be in groups, so partner up with someone you want to be with. Or, if you really want to, you can work alone. Hello? Can you please stop calling this number? Yeah, tell him this is getting old. Hey, I got this. My bad. It's all you. Go drink your sippy cup. I don't drink sippy cups anymore. Listen, you've been calling every day for the past two weeks. And he called during my nap time. Where's this guy? I'm gonna beat his. What did I say? That you got it. My bad. Why do you keep calling here if I tell you every time? Yeah, are you deaf? My man said no call. Hey! Gotcha. Taking a step back. Look, I don't care what you do, just don't call here again. Thank you. Who was that? Uh, hello? Ryan? Jimmy, don't touch that! Hey, dude. I need your help with something. Sorry, I'm busy buying shoes. Well, when you're done, come over. I can't find it. Can't find what? I can't find it. There's only soda. What do you mean there's only soda? It means there's only soda! Well, then get out of the soda aisle! All right! Jimmy! There's more soda! What do you mean there's more soda? There's just more soda! Or cola. Where are you? I'm at soda! What do you mean you're at soda? I mean I'm at soda! What store are you in? I'm at the soda store! That's why there's only soda! They also have baking soda. Why are you shopping for shoes at the soda store? Jimmy! Alright, tell me more about yourself. Well, I was born at a very young age, and I'm a former child. Well, you can't be lying, sir. Not what I'm concerned about. Where do you see yourself in five years? I'd say my biggest weakness is listening. Gotcha. Do you speak any other languages? I know a little Spanish. Oh, please demonstrate. All right. Suavemente. Whoa, huh, okay. If you could pick, what would be your dream job? Food consumption specialist. Yeah, get in line, kid. Do you have any good experience? Does Joe Biden? Point taken. You're hired, but your salary won't be good starting out. Not gonna work much until it is. Uh, I can't find my coat. Well, where did you put it? If I knew where I put it, I would have found it! Honey, it didn't just grow legs and walk away. No, I thought it got into a taxi and drove off! Oh, be careful with those. They're very sharp. The sword? The sword is sharp? I didn't think a 30-inch blade was sharp. I'd be lost without you, Mom. Oh, watch your step up there. Watch my step? You know, I thought about breaking 37 bones getting down from here, but uh, thank goodness you said that. Be careful, watch your head. Ah, uh, yeah, what good advice. Where would I be without you, Mom? How does he get away with talking like that? We, we can't do that. Don't look at me. I'm not allowed to speak. It's time for school. He's still sleeping. Ryan, come on. I packed your lunch for you. Your dad's got your bags all packed. Come on, you gotta get up. Five more minutes. Ryan, get up! <laughs> It's time for school! Oh. Oh. What's this? That's your lunch! Ryan, get up! It's 9 a.m. Alright, just another five minutes. I said, get up! But it's only 6 a.m. Now it's 10 a.m. Get moving! Dude, why did we fail this year? Well, a year has 365 days. And a year has 52 Sundays. With 50 days of summer holiday. 8 hours of daily sleep means 122 days. And 1 hour of daily play means 15 days. Along with 2 hours of daily eating adds up to 30 days. And 1 hour of talking every day makes up another 15 days. Oh, don't forget exam days add up to roughly 35 days. And all those times we go to functions, festivals, gatherings makes up at least 40 days. As well as a minimum of 3 days if we get sick with the flu or something. Together with at least 2 days watching movies and TV shows. And that leaves one day. That one day is your birthday. So that answers it. We just had no time to study. At all. Um, can I get something to eat? You ate two hours ago. Exactly. I ate a whole two hours ago. Hey, I'm expected to do everything around here and I haven't eaten in two days. I'm not expected to do anything. Sweet deal, ain't it? You, you guys are getting fed? Billy, nobody expects you. Yeah, bud, you're out of luck there. I love democracy. You're wrong, Jimmy. Mom and Dad love us all equally. Billy, they don't mean to have favorites. Billy, you guys just need help to understand. Maybe if I act better, I'll become the favorite. Yeah. You'll see. Can anyone give me an example of failure? Nope. Okay, what else? Wait, what? All right, I'm about to hand out the papers from yesterday, and Ryan, you failed your exam. So that means you failed to teach me. Are you talking back to me? That's how a conversation works. I also like to live dangerously. You think I'm stupid? Get in here! 
I don't care why you're late, but since you are, come and solve this problem on the boat. Oh, we got a problem? That's right. <laughs> I don't know how we got out of that. Yeah, I don't know how we're not six feet under right now. Hi there, I'm Android. We have a wide variety of phones for you to choose from. I'm Hello. I'm a, uh, Hello. I'm iPhone. We have Siri. We have the strongest battery life with over 10 hours of continuous use. With our phones, you have a weaker battery. I mean, a, a battery. A, 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 I mean a longer battery life. Now you can multitask with apps in split screen mode to be more efficient. And we have FaceTime, as well as using your phone to charge other phones with wireless power sharing. What else is there? FaceTime. Our new camera should have over 200 megapixels to take better photos than ever before. Did I mention Siri? Oh, I did. There's nothing else. And get off your lazy butt and go tell Jimmy I made him his favorite meal. All right. Mom, what about me? I haven't eaten in three days. And? Uh. Jimmy, Mom made you a sandwich. What are you guys doing? We're playing some Call of Duty. But Justin's blind. How are you? What guy should I be? How does he know what- Oh, I'm gonna be this guy. I haven't turned the PlayStation on yet. He can't see! Why would you play- He's fine! He can hear everything. I got sniped! Justin, the TV isn't even on yet. You guys have food? Who's that? Oh, it's Billy. Get out of here! You're throwing me off my game! The nerve of this kid. Get, Get lost, lost, Billy! Billy. Fine, I'm going! Oh, do you see that explosion? Did you? What? I died. Class, we're starting in five minutes. Remember to answer all the questions. No exceptions. Listen up, before we begin, note there are 10 questions, but you're only required to answer five questions. Everyone, this paper is multiple choice. All you have to do is choose A, B, C, or D for each question from the answers we give you. Cut the C and D. Only answer A and B. So, in short, your chances of passing this exam is 50-50. This is a reading exam, so just start reading. All right, we'll be starting any minute now. Eat. Sleep, cheat, I don't care, I can't stop you. Half of you is sitting there in your underwear anyway. Good luck. The leader for today. Everyone, you're choosing the leader for today. I hope it's me. <laughs> it's me, which means you all have to follow what I do or else you die. Timmy, you're gonna be a good leader, right? You're not gonna make us do anything like terrible. <laughs> okay, begin your exam. I don't wanna write my exam. Okay, everyone, take your exam paper, crumple it up, and throw it in the garbage. What? No, I need three days. I have to write this exam. Eugene, you have to follow what the leader says, or else you die. No, I have to get into Harford. I have to write... Everyone, stop. We're doing a hundred jumping jacks. Timmy, why? One, a hundred. Timmy, there was a lot of jumping jacks. Maybe we can drink some water? No, there's no time for that. We are going to rob a bank. They're changing the leader. The new leader. Hi, I need a job and I see you're hiring. Yeah, do you have any experience? Oh, no, uh, I just graduated. Sorry, can't help you. What do you mean? You need experience. But I need a job to get experience. No, you need experience to get a job. That's why I'm here. We have jobs here, not experience. Then where do I get the experience? Go work and you'll get it. How much experience do I need? 10 years. This is an entry-level position, right? Yes, you may enter after working for 10 years. I'm 19 years old! Was I meant to be working since I was 9?! Listen, David, it's Ryan. If you're not gonna come prepared, don't come at all. I think there's an exit-level job down the hall called my door. Bye-bye. Mom, he won't stop touching me! Mm -mm, I'm not touching you. Hey, that's the chair I wanted to sit on. Well, <laughs> it's mine now. Mom, he's looking at me all weird! Dad, he's breathing my air! Dad, he's breathing my air. Now he's copying me! Now he's copying me. Dad! Dad. Mom, he keeps looking out my window! Ah, get off! It's my turn to push the button! No! No! Don't touch me with your foot. My foot's touching your chair! But the chair is touching me! You're touching something that's touching me! Fine! You're still touching it! No, I'm not! With your toe! Freaking barely! Mom, he's touching something that's touching me! He's not letting my toe do what it wants! Mom, where's Jimmy? Why? He's in his room getting ready. He poured soda on my freaking PlayStation! Ready for what? We're not going out tonight, are we? No, we're not. He's going out with his friends to the movies. What? It's a school night! The parents will be there. They'll get him back before curfew. Curfew? He's ten years old! They grow up so fast, don't they? I was never allowed to go to a school night when I was his age, let alone have a curfew. He's becoming a man now. Didn't you hear what I said? He destroyed my PlayStation! Oh, yes, that reminds me. Christmas is just around the corner. Yeah, we should get him one. Oh, here he comes. Honey, remember to text me when you're safe with the movies. My name is Inigo Montoya. 
You killed my father. Prepare to bear. Please raise the right side. Alright, sir. Bro, is this yours? Yeah, I'm saving it for after I'm done here. Dude! No way to run. Now give me back what's left of mine. No, you've gone too far. It's high time someone teaches you who's in charge here. <laughs> Where did he get a sword from? Dude, I just realized that cowboys go yee-haw and ninjas go hee-yaw. Why are you the way you are? Why are you? Why? Bro, the letter W starts with a D. You always look up like that. What are you looking at? ATM fees is when you're just buying your own money. Now, I got a student card with student benefits. Fee free. You know what's crazy? Water. It can boil you to death, freeze you to death, and drown you. Yet you still need it to survive. Mom, he's back. Hello? The opposite of Microsoft Office is macro hard on fire. Stop! Boys, I gotta head out. So your mom's gonna be coming around to see if you clean your rooms. Doesn't matter, because I'm going to take a nap. Since when do we clean our rooms? You don't count. Ouch. You don't have a room. I'm sitting in it right now! Calm down. She won't do anything to you guys. Really? Well, maybe you should look in the smart part of your brain. Is this room clean? Yeah, yeah, mama. I've been to your room. If I were you, I'd shut my mouth right now and let the military officer take you away peacefully in 30 minutes. What? Billy, you pathetic li You... You actually cleaned your room. You're the only trash left. See? That's why I don't clean my room. To blend in. Anyone tell me an interesting fact about computers? Computers are the only thing where too much heat can cause freezing. He's out of line, but he's right. So class, I know your assignment was due for today, but I'm extending the due date to next week. Oh, thank goodness. I didn't do it. We had an assignment. I stayed up all night finishing it! Oh, poop. However, your essay is still due this period. I'll be coming around to collect them. Ryan, you're first. What? Uh, okay. Ryan, you had two weeks to write this essay. Yes. When did you start? Last night. You can't write an essay overnight! Listen up, class. You have one hour to write this essay. Begin. Oh. You're weak. You are always weak. Well done. Oh. Oh. <laughs> that was close one. for a second. I oh, want the close one. I need some air. I got life. This guy. I may not have finished this fast, but I am still the real smart kid. You are unworthy of these realms, unworthy of your title! You're unworthy! But you can't do this to me. You win some, you lose some. You know how much I sacrificed! You underestimate my power. You have misassessed my abilities below my competency level. I am much stronger than you perceive. Therefore, what you recognize as a tactical advantage in this battle is a grave miscalculation on your part. I scoff at your premature celebration of your triumph in our skirmish and regret to inform you that this contest has yet to conclude. For you see, I am much stronger than the inaccurate data you used to assess my abilities allowed you to figure. I am confident I can proceed in this course of action with minimal consequence or risk of injury. Ryan, you've been watching way too much TV lately. That's my TV. Go read something. Modern problems require modern solutions. 
Dude, just read a book. You're adopted. You have no say. And you expect me to believe that? What do I look like? I look like an idiot. I don't care what you believe. Everybody just calm down. Get him off my land. Let me tell you something, man. You're the trial run kid. I'm you, 2.0. New and improved. What does that make me? The one that made them lose hope and gave up trying. Says the adopted one. I'm not! Dad, am I adopted? Of course not. Why would I pick you? Twice the pride, double the fall. Dude, check this out. I found a new method to figure out this math problem. New ideas are fine, but they are also illegal. All right, pop quiz. Some preparation questions for the exam. Gregory, if you're skiing through the Amazon and your jetpack runs out of apple juice, what should you have on your head? Uh, a pterodactyl, because bubblegum makes bubbles. Correct. Sam, if you're swimming on Mount Everest and your duck eats a ukulele, what should you have under your big toe? A pizza, so you can tiptoe to the moon to buy shoelaces for your dinosaur. Precisely. You all seem to be good and ready for the exam. Now, let's move on. Sir? You raise your hand if you want to ask a question, boy. Sir? No talking in my class. But you just said... What do you want? Why is it so cold at the top of a mountain? Seconds of my life. I've never been more wasted than listening to you ask questions. Because the top of a mountain is actually closer to the sun. So why would it be cold? I think the school needs to give your parents a refund. Well, did you know that a frog can jump higher than an Eiffel Tower? Really? That's because an Eiffel Tower cannot jump. I'll trump that. You know dinosaurs can't eat fish even if they wanted to? Why not? Because they're dead. Well, you know the world famous actor The Rock isn't actually a rock. No kidding, Sherlock. Obviously, you moron. I'm failing as a teacher. Hello? Uh, excuse me? Are you my son's teacher? I am a teacher. Who's your son? Jimmy. <whistles> Jimmy Parker. Oh yeah, that thing. You gave my son detention for not doing his homework. Got that right. My son would never do something like that. That's why he got detention, Madam Karen. Excuse me? Dang. About time someone said it. My son always does his homework. You sure about that? He told me he's a straight-A student. You sure about that? I help him study every night. Ah, uh, that explains it. Explains what? Why your son's a moron! <gasps> he slacks off, never does his work, he's a failure! <gasps> Excuse me, I, I think the word you're searching for is Space Ranger. I'll have your job for saying that! Where's your principal? <laughs> Me, be a doll and go take out the trash. Oh, Mom, I always do all the chores around here. Please, let Billy or Jimmy do something. They never do anything. Five, four, three... All right, all right. Just stop counting. Oh. Billy, go take out the trash right now. Uh, not right now, Mom. I'll do it when I'm done here. Mom? Honey, if you're not too busy, Mommy and Dad have had a long day of work. Can you please take some time out of your busy schedule to take out the trash, please? No. Now, honey, I'm your mother. You have to listen to me. Five, four... What are you doing? Three... Th that's my thing. Two... Okay, okay, stop, stop counting. I'll, t I'll take out the trash. I'll get you some apple juice while I'm at it, all right? Can't be serious. You stayed up till 9 p.m.? Best believe it. That's pretty impressive, dude. Yeah, hats off to you. My mom would never let me do that. Dude, where were you yesterday? Did you bunk class? No, my mom let me stay home so we could have a long weekend. You, sir, are the MVP. You are why we invented class presidents. Hey, dude, I had to sleep over at Jason's house yesterday. It was awesome. Hold up. Yesterday was a Tuesday. Yeah? What's your point? You had a sleepover on a school night? How did you pull that off? Sometimes my genius. It generates gravity. This just in. I slept last night. By the beard of Sirius. Great Odin's raven. How? How can this be? Eight full hours. Knights of Columbus. Gabe. Uh, yes, sir. Is it possible to learn this power? Third. Red light. No, no, I'm losing my balance. <laughs> Looks like learning was more important than living. <laughs> Green light. Lana, are you okay? I've really got a sneeze. Red light! You look like you really want to let out that sneeze, huh? You can, but if you do, you'll be out. <laughs> Green light! Hey, Timmy, look. Paper plane. Whoa, throw it here. Red light! Ouch, you threw it right at my eye. Ah, uh, poor Timmy. Green light! No, Lana, what have you done? 
It's all your fault. My twin brother Timmy's dead. Hey, I'm really sorry for what happened to Timmy. I red light. Why so serious? <laughs> Green light. I never meant for anyone to get hurt. I'm so sorry. This is for <sighs> Timmy. Red light. So 32 degrees Fahrenheit is equal to zero degrees Celsius. That means zero degrees Celsius plus zero degrees Celsius equals 64 degrees Fahrenheit. No way. I saw you get in here. You're late, to say the least. Did you do your homework? Did you grade my assignment? I have other students' assignments to grade. I have other teachers' homework to do. Go sit down. Did, did he just crack the code? Now copy these notes carefully. They will all be on the test. All right, no problem. As long as I can get them down, I'll be good. And by good, you mean I'm going to outshine all of you, as always. Now, moving on. Why did I even come well, to Well, guess I'm- Fred is here! Everyone knows the definition of photosynthesis, right? Yes, sir. But sir, in reality, plants are actually farming us. Enlighten me. Well, by giving us oxygen daily until we all eventually decompose so they can consume us. Well... Hmm. Dude, what have you done to our teacher? Sometimes I'll start a sentence. And I don't even know where it's going. I just hope I find it along the way. Good morning, class. I'll be your substitute for the next four years. And your teacher, Mr. Johnson, said to give each of you separate 10-page essay assignments every day, followed by three pop quizzes and a daily four-hour presentation in front of the whole school. Because he said, and I quote, I don't need sleep. I need answers. That didn't go the way you thought it would. Nope. Boys and girls, I hope you're all ready for the practical examinations tomorrow. Kowalski. Sorry, sir, no clue. We don't have to study this topic, dude. It won't come up in the exam. Right. I'm ready for that exam. Bank on it. Here we go again. If I banked on you, I'd go bankrupt. Want me to prove it? That you're an idiot? Because you're living proof. All right, get up here. Write the formula for sodium formate. All right. Hakuna Matata! Well, in that case... I know that too. I also know that one. You're speechless because all the words in your head have been sucked out by the magnetism of my genius. I finally finished it! What? This 50 piece puzzle! It says seven plus years, but I finished it in less than four! So you took- Am I not the king?! So you took just under 10 months to get only 10 pieces every time? No, I did three pieces in t five months and 12 pieces in 12 months. Why is my math not mathing? I think your brain's not braining, as always. Ryan, it's Mother's Day, so where are you taking me out to eat? Well, like you always say, Mom. Get ready, everybody. He's about to do something stupid. We have food at home? Say that again. Not yet! I double dare you! Come on! We have food at home. Wait, what? Remember me. No, come on, Billy, come on. Remember that time I gave you that cookie? Remember? Remember? No. Guys, I'm getting ready to go out. How do I look? Mom? Hush, little baby. My beautiful baby boy. Thanks, Mom. Bro? So, how do I look? Come on. This is actually the best you've ever looked. Should have expected that. Hey, sis. Why do I ask you two things? Grandma? Hmm? The most handsome human being in existence. Thanks, Grandma. I can always count on you. Grams? Grams? Can, can you see me? Just below average. I'll take it. Dad? You look like that thing that does nothing around here, yet eats all my money. Well, uh, uh, Hey, Rebecca. Uh, you look beautiful tonight. I don't even know who you are. You think you should be the leader of this house? I am. Hold on, there, there's a lot to consider. What is there to talk about? I take the blame for literally everything. And I literally pay for everything. Have you seen your food bills? Not cheap, I'll tell you that much. That hardly seems fair, Dad. I mean, we pay our fair share from time to time. Your allowance comes from me. You're paying me with my own money, genius. 
you know, he's got a point. Shut it. There are many things to consider in being a leader, like doing every conceivable chore invented by the COP. COP? Council of Parents. What good is doing chores if your weaknesses outweigh them tenfold? What is that supposed to mean? You suck at doing chores, Einstein! <laughs> He's got you there, Ryan. Like you're any better. Every toy you have, you throw away after three minutes of looking at it, and your attention span is worse than the dumbest goldfish out there. What? Ooh. And you! Who, who are you again? Oh yeah! Uno! Hey, why are you shouting? I'm right here. What? No, Dad, you call that out when you have one card left in your hand, and one step away from beating you! We'll see about that, won't we, Mom? I don't know what you're talking about, son. I'm on no one's team. I love and support all my children equally. Oh, really? Well, then, can I play with you guys? Did you guys hear something? Nope. <sighs> Nothing. Didn't hear a thing. Dad, it's your turn. Uno! Dad, you can't say Uno. You still have two cards in your hand. Oh. Dos! Let's go, Mom. I'd like to see how you're gonna save your favorite child this time. I have absolutely no idea what you're talking about, Ryan. Go, Jimmy! With pleasure. Reverse! Reverse! Reverse, 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 reverse. Uno, draw four, change the color to red. He is inevitable. Oh, class, what motivates you to come to school? Well, uh. What? Are you trolling? That's like asking what motivates you to get shot in the groin. Or like what motivates me to pay taxes. Which we don't learn about here anyway. Are we actually supposed to be motivated to be here? If that were true, I'd bring my brain with me. Well, it motivates me to get a job as a factory worker. Calm down, dude. You were headed there anyway. Class, this is a legitimate question. What is your motivation to come to school? Okay. Recess. Chilling in the bathroom during class. To pull pranks. Cause why not? To use the homework I get as fire starters for a barbecue. To catch up on my sleep. To look at you and be reminded what not to be when I grow up. I'd say to study, do my classwork, and to learn. Who let that kid in here? Okay, now that you've all recognized your motivations to be here, use it. Embrace it. To do this. We have been bamboozled. Ryan, since you like talking so much, it's your turn to read to the class. Come on, get up here. She didn't want to eat dinner because she doesn't like chicken noodle soup. Now class, from that sentence, even though it doesn't say so, we can infer that 17 years ago she encountered an attack from chickens while on a trip to Africa to visit her great uncle that was dying from pneumonia that he contracted from chickens that were being harvested for the great feast. What a bold and powerful statement about the futility of existence. Right. Maybe she just doesn't like chicken noodle soup, sir. The impudence! The audacity! The unmitigated gall! Never mind. Well, here's one for you, sir. How do you make one vanish? How? Add a G and it's gone. Oh, I see you found my gift. What? You put the spider there? Why? You said you were constipated, right? Yeah. And that spider scared the out of you, didn't it? Well, yeah, and I think a little more. You're welcome. Go get it out of there! You, you didn't squash it? I'm sorry, I was too busy pooping out half my intestines when I saw that thing! It literally caught me while my pants was down! You put it there, you get it out. Give me my weapon. The napkin. Got him. Dude, we lived on the second floor. You really had to burn down the whole building? Couldn't risk it. That spider saw my face. Get out. What? You are a walking hurricane. Get out! Don't you talk, Ryan. You do nothing around here and you eat all the food in this house. So much so, I forgot we might have even had a third child. Wait. Didn't we have a third child? Yeah, Mom. Me. Nah, I must be thinking of one of your friends, Jimmy. Friend? That's me, Mom! You're thinking of the neighbor's kid, honey. Huh. Be nicer to your brother. What do you want? I don't know. That took too long. So... I'll be back. All right, Twinkle Toes. I've been thinking. Mom was right. You want to hang out today? Where's my leftovers? That was a good snack. Thanks. You ate it? It was real good. Your life 
And today! You sure about that? Those Cheerios are melting your pea brain. Well, you've actually always been this stupid. You mean the pea brain using Camp Scanner to send a detailed picture of your failed report card that got here a few days ago you tried to hide from mom and dad in the pantry closet? Checkmate. I only got one heart left. I know what to do. Whoa, Luna looks hot. Yeah, girl, come sit with us. Yesterday, when you told me that I couldn't sit with you guys, you made me lose a heart. And I can trust you guys won't do that again. You never even deserved it in the first place. Babe, you look so good today. I'm not your babe. Yesterday, you didn't want to be with me because I had pimples. And you broke my heart, now I only have one. I can trust that you won't do that again to me. I'm sorry. Class, we have a new student today. Everyone meet John. You can sit wherever you like, John. Hey, can I sit here? Sure, do whatever you want. Like me, I get to sit next to the prettiest girl in class. No, I'm not interested, okay? I can't risk it getting involved with another person again. Hey, wait, why did you say that you can risk getting involved with another person? I only have one heart left. If I get heartbroken again, I'll die. I only have one heart left, too. How about we take the risk together? Dude, can I blow your mind? Instead of letting me finish the work we're supposed to be doing? Yes. Trust me on this one. You don't want to know. Johnny? Don't tell him. You shouldn't have told me, but you did. And now I'm telling you, you don't want to know. Now I'm intrigued. People singing happy birthday to you is like an unskippable ad in real life. Alright class, did you have any homework for today? Oh, I forgot. Oh yeah, we did. W what class is this? Was it really for today? He's a kid, right? Yes sir, we actually had quite a lot to do. Everyone is stupid except me. Okay, now before I go around and collect your homework, pop quiz! That's you! What's the answer? I don't know. Did you break it down? Oh, dang. My bad. He's my protege, sir. Class, the word problem on the worksheet in front of you states that if David drives- Hey, David! David! I know. My name's on the worksheet. I'm famous now. Famously moronic, famously idiotic, famously boneheaded, famously pinheaded. <clears throat> the famous failure. All right, I get it, gee! Again, if dumb David, the famous failure, drives to his friend's house, which is 450 miles away in six hours, what is the average speed David has to drive? Timothy? Wait, d don't ask him, sir. He's the class idiot. He knows everything about nothing. Hey, joke's on you. I know nothing about everything. The answer is 75 miles per hour, sir. I'm impressed. <laughs> Although, even a blind squirrel finds a nut once in a while. Uh, actually, sir, a squirrel's eyes are positioned in such a way that they can see behind them. So I doubt they go blind. Well, even a stop clock is right twice a day. Dude, can you show me how to use that? And if it helps you, it'll help me. <sighs> These students are a nightmare. What do you mean? What do you mean? What do I mean? You're a teacher. Wait. You're the new substitute teacher. Yeah, I arrived this morning. So it's your first day here and you've never taught a class before. Yeah, but I mean, how hard could it be? <laughs> Go ahead, take my class for the day. Oh, thank you. Uh, you sure? You're gonna die. What? I said you'll do great. Down the hall there. See you later. Good morning, class. Stop eating my pencil! Who are you? Where did you come from? All right. Another one for us to beat down. Dude, don't even. Stacy's five foot tall and she kicked your butt yesterday and bent you like a pretzel at the jungle gym. Give this new one a break, guys. He looks smart, and we're grateful to have you to teach us, sir. Thank you. Now, uh... Pop quiz! And also a 5,000 word essay due tomorrow morning. <laughs> sir? Boys, listen, I know we haven't seen eye to eye. Yeah, Billy's invisibility should come in real handy here. Hey! I am done being persecuted for my strength. Listen! Whatever comes out of these gates, we've got a better chance of survival if we work together. Do you understand? We're with you. Certainty of death, small chance of success. What are we waiting for? Oh. Abandon your post! What? Please save my life! I'm out! No, 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 wait! It's all you, bro! You got this! Jimmy? It's all here, Mom. They broke the TV. 
Jimmy, you told her? Hold up. You use chem scanner to scan a report of confession? Where'd you even get that? Just looking out for number one. What do you mean? You're not even the one in danger. Dang. Billy actually got away scot-free. Oh, Billy? I saw him in the driveway. Which way did he go? Well... Occasionally I'll hit somebody with my car. So sue me. Sir, no, you can't go to the bathroom. This is science class, right? Oh, is it? I didn't notice. Why are wet clothes darker even though water has no color? Because mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. I mean, water is transparent, so... Your brain is transparent. Why does it make the color of a cloth darker? Ryan, here's a question. Science project, due tomorrow. You done? Right. The project. The project for tomorrow. The project specifically required for tomorrow. Tomorrow's project. The Tomorrow Project. That project? I hate so much about the things that you choose to be. That was the hint! Get out! Oh, sorry, okay. Our list of allies grows thin. Now class, what is the answer to this main I know this biologic... This is useless here. Years of academy training. Jimmy, you better start getting your act together. This is the third test you failed! Horribly! What about question five? That counted the most points, and I know I got that one right. You mean the question, who was the first president of the United States? Yeah, that one. I said our good old boy George. Clooney! You said George Clooney! Well, didn't he play president that Get one out! time? Get <sighs> out! Honey, I made you a sandwich so you can eat while you go study. Study? Yeah, the algebra test that counts for 80% of your final grade that you been studying so hard for. Yeah. Mom, Ryan was in my class a few years ago, right? Yeah, but you'll do way better. Hey, numb nuts, mom butch. What are you stealing mom. from me now? I need this to study and Ryan won't let me have it. Mom, that's my old test paper. Ryan, for once, be useful in this house and let's- Fine. You know what, keep it here. Uh, this is old and wrinkled. I'll send you a picture of it so you don't have to struggle while you study. All right. Here you go, Jimmy. Another one. Dude, mm. you know your handwriting is your hand's accent. So your hand is cartoony? Ryan, principal, now. What? Why? I did my homework this time. Wait, where is it? He's probably just proud he can spell his name right this time. For your information, fart for brains, I used question AI to get all the answers. D don't you call that cheating? <gasps> sir, sir, he cheated! Shut it! First off, I did not cheat. I used question AI to take a photo of the homework and then I get all the answers in just a few seconds with step-by-step -step explanations. You can do the same with it for anything you get in a textbook or a test. So let me get this straight. Basically memorizing something is cheating. What? You ignored everything I just said. No, no, hear me out. You knew the answer before the test was given. So by saying you gain the knowledge before the test to use on the test is cheating. Yes! You could also say if you don't know the questions in the test, how do you know which answers will be right? I'm surrounded by idiots. Miss Jacobs, your son is exhibiting bad behavior. And he exhibits bad behavior at home too. But do I ever call you? Fine, where's my phone? I don't know. Why should I care? The phone's not letting me play games on it anymore. Fix it. Ah! Billy, take my phone, call customer service, and fix your phone so Jimmy can play. Ah! Fine! <laughs> customer service. Hi, my phone won't let me do- Customer service. Hello? Can you hear me? What seems to be the problem, sir? My phone won't let me open any gaming apps. And why should I care? It's your job. My job to do what? To care. You're called customer care! Sir, we're called customer service, not customer care. We don't care. Please, calm down, sir. I am calm. You just seem to need help figuring out- Help with what, sir? To know what your job is! <clears throat> Please hold. Please remain on the line as we value your call. All right, sir. Thank you for waiting, but I'm afraid there's nothing we can do. Now, could you please rate my service from 1 to 10? Excuse me, sir. Is this class number 3? Who are you? That's the new kid, sir. Did I ask you? I'm just trying to help. Help yourself to passing my class. What's your name? Ethan without the K. Oh my gosh, another idiot. I know there's no K in Ethan. That's what I just said. Is he always like this? Seven years per hour here. Take a seat, bucko. Next to Billy. <laughs> G Don't freaking mess with me. Hopefully you'll do better than the rest here. How hard could it be? The mission. The nightmares. They're finally over. Not quite. 
You failed. Huh? And so did you, Ryan. Looks like you'll be in my class again next year, Ryan. Are you trying to hurt my feelings? Fortunately, my feelings regenerate at twice the speed of a normal man's. Hi there, sir. Welcome to Ripoff. Can I help you find anything? Hi, yeah. My friend told me you guys have good deals. I'm looking to buy the new Samsung. Oh, no, sorry, sir. We don't have Samsungs. We have Samsungs. What? Yeah, it's way better. It's more of an in-the-now kind of phone. Okay, does it use Android? No, even better. Humanoid. A phone that can talk to you about your feelings. Yeah, I don't need that. Uh, all right, so do you know of any good shoe stores nearby? Oh, we have shoes. You do? Do you have any Nike? We have Psyche. Like Nike, but not. Well, at least the name is up front with you. Any Adidas? Adidas. Skechers? Tackies. Vans? Wagons. Under Armour? Overshield. Asics? Buttocks. All right, I'm going home. I'm going to go watch some Marvel. We got Marvel movies. Oh, really? Got the Avengers? No, we got the Paybackers, an exclusive release into their B-team. I'm afraid to ask. Iron Man? Plastic Fellow. Spider-Man? Bug Boy. Thor? Storm Boy. Hulk? Big Boy. I will burn this place to the ground. Goodbye. All right, have a good day, sir. Follow us on Exchangeagram at Excuse Ripoff. me, sir. Can you help me find the Doctor Strange movie? Oh, you mean Mr. Weird. I got you. Hey. Bro, what I miss? Dude, you should have seen it. There were like 10 fights in the hallway yesterday. 10? It was way more than that. It was an all-out brawl. Are you serious? Freaking Royal Rumble, my dude. That's nothing. Tell him what happened after that. Wh why? What happened after that? Well, the principal saw that, and he was so proud of all of us being proactive that he took the entire school on a trip to Disney World. In Paris. You're kidding. And we ran into Elon Musk and went on rides with him all day and he gave us all first class tickets back. But dude, when we got back... Wow. What? What? Elvis Presley, Bob Marley, and Michael Jackson all came back to life for one day to perform in the cafeteria like the world has never seen before. Yes, seriously. My life has peaked. And to top it all off... How the heck is there more? You know that teacher that no one likes? She said that for every student that was in class yesterday will get a guaranteed A in the final. But that's like six months from now. Exactly. And after all that, you're the only one that wasn't here. You missed out, dude.